Hello, so while I've been on break, I've been getting lots of video requests, one of which was a circuit that alternates lights by the flick of a switch. Now, not too long back, I did a video on automatic lights using a HBHF sensor, and I've put it up in the cards now. That means you don't have to worry about switches at all. As it turns out, a lot of you prefer the mechanical approach. So here's a video on how to do it with only one switch, and it'll save a little bit of time, a couple of resources, and a lot of effort. Now I get where you're coming from, nothing worse than coming home after a session of being a bell and having to search around for the light switch in the base. Now with this circuit you can switch upstairs on for example and downstairs off and vice versa and it gives you a little bit more time so you can get back outside and start doming some nakeds on a beach. Now for this setup all you're going to need is a power source, two branches, a blocker, a standard switch and some lights. That's it. Now start by placing the switch in the position you want it on the wall. When placing the rest of the components, I'd recommend hiding them away somewhere and not leaving them out in the open for obvious reasons. Now first things first, you need to place a branch on either side of the switch. Place the blocker above this and that'll make wiring it up much easier and you'll be able to remember it a little bit better as well. So first of all, power your first branch using whichever source of power you've chosen. And then the branch out, the left hand one, needs to go into the bottom of the blocker to power that. Once you've done that, the power out of the same branch will power the switch. Once you've done that, the next branch out of your second branch will go into the block pass through of the blocker. That's in the side of the blocker. And the main power will power a set of lights. The output of the blocker will power your second set. Finally, the power out from the switch will power that second branch. And that's it. That's as simple as it is. So when you switch the switch, power will change in this case from upstairs to downstairs and vice versa. Job done. Now you can upgrade this by adding a second switch between your power source and the first blocker. So you can choose when to activate it and not waste power like if you're out of the base or it's through the day. You can also upgrade it by passing more lights through it if you want to make the rooms brighter or put different rooms into your base and have them lighting up at the same time. Just remember when you do this, you will require more power. So make sure you set your first branch to reflect the amount of lights or items you're powering. For example, a light uses two power, so two lights will use four power. Quick maths, hence setting the branch to four and so on. Now you don't have to stop there. This circuit is interchangeable, meaning you don't need to power lights. You can use turrets or sound systems and you can alternate between them. You can power doors and have them alternating between each other with a simple flick of a switch. It's up to you. Now I want to say at this point, thank you for everyone what's stuck by me. I have had a, a couple of months out just to have a, a break and work on other projects. Um, I will be making a comeback to YouTube though and get much more of these videos out. I'm hoping for weekly uploads now again. Um, so thank you to everyone, whether you're a new or old subscriber. Um, a special thank you as well to my patrons, which you can see on screen now. Really appreciate you sticking through. Let me know if you want to see any videos in the comments down below and I'll add them to the list and start working on them. Thanks again, and as usual, I'll see you in the next video.